Are we rolling? We're rolling? We're rolling. Okay, we're good. Welcome to the Apple family history of mustard. Today we're going to talk to you about the Apple family history of the stash, the old mustache. Now it started way, way back in the day with my great, 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 great grandfather, Ulysses Cornelius Jedediah Apple. Now he had a big bushy stash, you know, it did one of these, hold on, hold on. And he called it the old waft. <laughs> now what people, now what people didn't know was Ulysses was big friends with Taft. And Taft saw that bushy stash and he was like, you know what, I'm gonna grow me one of them. So he grew it and it became known as the Waft Taft. And he became president and it just became known as the Taft. Some people would try to call it the Claft, but we know why they can't, can't call it that. My great, great grandfather, his name was Thomas Scartholomew Apple. And what he had, he had one of these, like, these little things right here and he always hung out in Hollywood with Charlie Chaplin. They were like great buddies, but I don't think it actually caught on until he started doing business in Germany in the late 20s. Oh, this is good. My father, the old man, his name was Mark Martholomew Apple, and he was a big influence on the 70s and TV's 80s stars. You didn't know this, but Tom Selleck never had a mustache until he met my father. Now, he had a big, big one. Does, does he still have it? He never met James Garner. And sure enough, James Garner never had a mustache. Did you know that? <laughs> yeah, he knew McMillan, not the wife. He knew one Simon, not the other. Yeah, I think that's, that's about it. That's who he influenced. Now, if you notice myself, I have a mustache. It's, Okay, it's actually, it's on loan though, because my wife made me shave it off because she said it was too scratchy. <laughs> Joke's on her though, because she kicked me out. <laughs> that guy's got the right idea. Hmm. Oh, don't worry, this is just orange juice laced with a lot of vodka. Anyway. <laughs> If anyone knows of a place I can stay or how to get through air ducts, please let me know and we, we can talk. Uh, I'm Scott Apple. I still don't have a place to live. My wallet's inside and I'm locked out. 